Hi friends, in this video I will explain how to create action button, macro and link the macro to the action button. First let us format this Google Sheet. The Google Sheet has got 21 columns. Format alternate columns and select amber color. All right. Now it looks much better. Okay. I would like to place the action button in these two cells. Let me highlight it. Okay. As you move up and down and right, the action button will disappear. So let us freeze the column and row. Two rows. Columns. Now fine. Let me create action button. Insert drawing. Select a shape. Double click. This is the action button which will take you to column header order ID. You have here option options to format, color as well as font. So let me reduce. So here you have multiple options. Let me reduce the font size to Reduce the font size to 11 and reduce the size a little. Now save, it comes here. So just select, pull it and put it here. Now we need a macro. To create a macro, click here, macro, record macro. Use your cursor, select U2 column save it here go to order id copy this i will tell you next here select there are three buttons click on that assign script paste that macro name click ok now when you click this button the cursor will <coughs> take you to order ID column. Before that, you need to uh, authenticate the script one time. This is a normal procedure in Google Sheet. Click authorization requested, continue, select your Gmail account and say allow. Click allow. Now, if you are here, click order ID, it will take you there. Let me sh show you the script macro extension, macro manage macro. Here you see we have only one macro, so it shows only one, otherwise it will list more. Now, edit script. This is the script. One is to select activate the sheet, another one is to activate the cell U2. Now here you will notice that U2 is hard coded. Suppose if you are in row 500, when you click, you will, it will take you to row 2. That's not uh, what we require. We, we, need, we need the cursor to move to U500 when you are in the row 500. Okay, now I have for that actually you need the active cell row number column. Yes, we have. We need to uh, you know combine the column number and active row number. Active row number. Okay, I have the script. Okay. 
just let us use the same name and uh, rename this okay this is to activate the spreadsheet select the sheet in that sheet see we need to go to u the current cell is u plus get row number so when you are in uh, in in any cell for example if you are in a a500 it the it, this will get that row number as 500 and combine it with u and put it put it in this as variable and it will activate okay control s to save click back now suppose you are in row 90 click takes you to the right similarly you can add another macro for example to come back to product category f so you can create another one as F save it control S now go back draw another action button this time you take some other form you can choose arrow anything so let us choose square double click product category reduce the size font change the color back color change the font color bold italics set click here you copied and kept the name this is the one now click it takes you to this place keep your uh, sorry keep here keep here click it comes back that's all thank you for watching if you need any other option in google sheet kindly add your comments thank you for watching subscribe to my channel if you like the video i have videos on r programming machine learning and data science kindly watch all those videos as well. Thank you. Bye.